Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Fedora Linux 41 on VirtualBox in Windows environment. Go to Fedora Linux official website that is fedoraproject.org. Hit enter, click on latest release that is 41 or click on here or get Fedora. All three are same. Okay. So click on get Fedora. Then see here we have the editions, workstation, server, core OS, IoT and cloud. In this video, we are going to install workstation. I will make another video for this server. Okay. So click on workstation. Click on download. See here, we have the ISO for Intel and AMD systems. So click on this download button. See, download has been started. Go to downloads. See, it's a size is 2.3 gigabytes. I am cancelling this one because see here, I have already downloaded it. In your case, wait until download completes. Once download is completed, then open Oracle VM Virtual Box. See, I have installed Oracle VM Virtual Box on my Windows machine. If you haven't installed Oracle VM Virtual Box on your machine, then go to the link provided in the video description and install it. Click on it to open. See, these are the list of the virtual machines installed on my PC. To create new virtual machine, you have to click on new or machine and select new. Both are same. Select new. Now provide the name for the virtual machine. See, this is the just name for the Fedora Linux virtual machine, not for the host. Now select the folder to store this virtual machine files and folders. Then in the drop down, select the other, then select the path, here you have the NS space. Create new folder, then give name. 41, 41 is the Fedora version. Hit enter, select the folder, then ISO image. Select the downloaded ISO image. Click on other, then select the downloaded ISO file. Click on open. See, it has selected type as Linux and version as Fedora Linux 64 bit. Okay, so click on next. Now select the base memory. I am giving 4 gigabytes. Then give the two processes. It's up to you. Click on next. Virtual disk. I am going to give 100 gigabytes. It is also up to you. So click on next. See, this is the summary of the virtual machine. Click on finish. If you want to edit, select the mesh, select the virtual machine from this list and click on settings. Or right click and select the settings. Or select it and machine and select settings. All three options are same. If you are working with all these settings, then you have to click on start. Or right click and select the start. Okay. And select the start, then normal start. Okay. So click on start. Use up and down arrows and select the first one that is start Fedora workstation live 41 and hit enter. See here, click on install Fedora. Select the language and click on continue. Now, this is the installation summary. See, begin installation has been grayed out because the colors with red highlighted must be selected. So, click on installation destination. I am okay with the default one, so click on done. And if you want to set the time zone, time and date, you have to click on this time and date, then select the region and city. Okay. You can select from the drop down for the region and select the city. See, it has selected automated date and time. Okay. If you want to set the manual, you have to select here. Okay. I am okay with the default one, so click on done. See, now we are able to click on begin installation. So click on begin installation. See, installation has been started. This may take time. I am pausing this video. It will ask at the end to restart the this virtual machine. So I am pausing this video.
see installation has been completed click on finish installation before reboot you have to click on here and select the remote disk from virtual machine virtual device now click on this power button then click on this power on power off button then click on restart okay click on it it is confirmation click on restart click on next i don't want to enable third party repositories so click on next provide username then click on next provide the password for this user then click on next start using fedora linux okay now click on menu click on show applications see these are the default applications comes with fedora linux click on terminal font is too low so let us increase preferences scroll down select the path drop down select the custom font increase it mono space regular select it click on it okay close this one see now font has been increased now verify the version of the fedora more slash etc os hyphen release hit enter see we have installed fedora linux 40 workstation edition you to quit so the first step after connecting to is we have to run the command we have to update the packages sudo dnf update hyphen y ampersand ampersand sudo dnf upgrade hyphen y hit enter provide the password of sudo user hit enter this may take time so in this video we have seen how to download and install fedora linux 41 on virtual box for more fedora or linux tutorials please subscribe my channel thank you